Jim Carrey, the man behind the laughter. If Jim Carrey, the famous comic actor, had taken a beating after being rejected as a performer the first few times, we would not have had great movies like Bruce Almighty and The Truman Show. James Eugene Carey was born on January 17, 1962, in Newmarket, Ontario, Canada, as the youngest of four children. Carey's early life was shaped by a mix of joy, hardship, and resilience. His father, Percy Carey, was a talented saxophonist who gave up his musical ambitions to provide a stable income for his family by working as an accountant. His mother, Kathleen, stayed at home to care for the family, fostering Jim's lively imagination and humor. The Carey family faced significant financial difficulties, especially when Percy lost his job, pushing them into a period of deep poverty. Forced to live in a van for a time, the family's struggles left a lasting mark on Jim. He turned to humor as both an escape and a way to bring laughter into his household. His father, who saw Jim's talent, encouraged his son's comedy ambitions. Even at a young age, Carey would perform skits and impressions to entertain classmates and family, sparking his love for making people laugh. By his early teens, Carey was performing stand-up routines at local comedy clubs in Toronto. Despite a challenging start, he remained committed to perfecting his craft, dropping out of high school at age 16 to pursue comedy full-time. His drive eventually led him to the United States, where he sought to break into Hollywood, first struggling and then achieving stardom with his unique blend of humor, energy, and heart. Breakthrough in Comedy and Film Jim Carrey's breakthrough in comedy and film came after years of persistence and a transformative stint on the sketch comedy show In Living Color. In the late 1980s, after moving to Los Angeles, Carrey had struggled to gain traction in Hollywood. However, his distinct comedic style, characterized by exaggerated expressions and physical agility, caught the attention of Keenan Ivory Wayans, who cast him on in Living Color in 1990. Carey's performances on the show, where he created iconic characters like the eccentric, Fire Marshal Bill, displayed his versatility and fearlessness, setting him apart in the world of comedy. In 1994, Carey's film career exploded with an unprecedented trio of box office hits, Ace Ventura, Pet Detective, the Mask, and Dumb and Dumber. Each of these movies showcased different facets of his talent, from slapstick antics to inventive improvisation. Ace Ventura, his first major leading role, became a cultural phenomenon, turning Carey's character into an instant icon of 1990s comedy. The Mask allowed him to explore a more fantastical, animated style of comedy, while Dumb and Dumber, co-starring Jeff Daniels, cemented his status as a comedic powerhouse. These successes launched Carey into Hollywood's elite, giving him the freedom to experiment further with roles. He followed up with Batman Forever, 1995, as the flamboyant Riddler, and Liar Liar, 1997, where he delivered a mix of comedy and heart, earning him his first Golden Globe nomination. Carey's 1990s roles were game-changing not only for his career but for comedy itself. His success proved that a combination of high-energy humor and unique character-driven performances could achieve mainstream popularity, paving the way for new comedic styles in Hollywood. A Master of Comedy and Drama Jim Carrey's evolution from slapstick comedy to nuanced drama showcased his extraordinary versatility and marked a new phase in his career. After his initial string of hit comedies, Carrey surprised audiences and critics alike by taking on more serious, layered roles that demonstrated his depth as an actor. His first major foray into drama came with The Truman Show, 1998, a film in which he played Truman Burbank, a man unknowingly living his entire life on a reality television show. Carey's portrayal was sensitive and introspective, 
exploring themes of identity, freedom, and surveillance with subtle humor and humanity. This performance earned him a Golden Globe for Best Actor, signaling his transition to dramatic roles. Following The Truman Show, Carey took on Man on the Moon, 1999, a biographical film about the eccentric comedian Andy Kaufman. Known for his immersive method acting, Carey famously embodied Kaufman's unique personality on set, blurring the lines between himself and his character. This dedication earned him another Golden Globe, as well as lasting recognition for his ability to channel complex, unconventional figures. In 2004, Carey further cemented his status as a skilled dramatic actor with Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind, directed by Michel Gondry. Playing the melancholic and reserved Joel Barish, Carey delivered a deeply emotional and restrained performance, exploring themes of love and memory. His chemistry with co-star Kate Winslet, along with his ability to communicate raw vulnerability, resonated with audiences, solidifying Eternal Sunshine as one of his most acclaimed works. Carey's later career saw him return to drama with the number 23, 2007, and the television series Kidding, 2018-2020, where he portrayed a children's television host grappling with personal tragedy. While still performing comedy, Carey continued to seek roles that allowed him to explore psychological and emotional depth. Jim Carey's transition to drama revealed a profound sensitivity and courage in his craft, proving him to be not just a master of comedy but a versatile actor unafraid to tackle complex roles. His journey redefined his legacy, showcasing him as an artist capable of moving audiences with both laughter and introspection. Challenges and Personal Growth Despite his immense success on screen, Jim Carrey's personal life has been marked by profound challenges and introspective growth. Known for his boundless energy and humor, Carey faced battles behind the scenes that often contrasted sharply with his comedic persona. He has openly discussed his struggles with depression, a condition he has grappled with for years. Carey's introspective nature and search for meaning led him to explore mindfulness, spirituality, and self-discovery as ways to cope and grow beyond his challenges. Carey also experienced painful personal losses, including the tragic passing of his former girlfriend, Catriona White, which drew media scrutiny and deeply affected him. These events led him to seek solace and expression through art, especially painting and sculpture, which became essential to his personal healing and a new creative outlet. His artwork, often bold, surreal, and politically charged, allowed him to communicate emotions and views he found difficult to express in words, helping him reconnect with himself in a deeply therapeutic way. In recent years, Carey has embraced a more philosophical approach to life, often discussing themes of identity, purpose, and the nature of fame. He has become an advocate for living authentically, shedding the need for external validation that drove his earlier career. His journey through mental health challenges and personal loss transformed his perspective, encouraging him to pursue roles and projects with greater personal significance. Through his openness about his struggles, Carey has inspired others by showing that fame and success don't shield one from life's difficulties. His commitment to personal growth and authenticity has added a new layer to his legacy, revealing a complex, introspective individual beyond the on-screen laughter. Legacy and Cultural Impact Jim Carrey's legacy is defined by his transformative influence on both comedy and cinema, as well as his ability to resonate with audiences across genres and generations. From his early slapstick humor to his later dramatic roles, Carrey's work pushed the boundaries of performance, blending physicality, expressiveness, and a willingness to be vulnerable that few actors had achieved before him. His unique approach to comedy, relying on his elastic facial expressions and intense energy, inspired a generation of comedians and actors to explore a more dynamic, liberated style of humor. 
Carrie's impact extends beyond the screen. Movies like Ace Ventura, Pet Detective and The Mask have become cultural staples, referenced and celebrated decades after their release. His films often reflected the quirks and nuances of society, offering sharp, comedic commentary on topics ranging from fame and reality TV, The Truman Show, to existential questions about memory and love, eternal sunshine of the spotless mind. Through these iconic roles, Carey became a voice of his era, balancing outrageous humor with relatable, thought-provoking insights. Beyond acting, Carey's openness about mental health, spirituality, and his philosophical reflections on life have broadened his influence. By speaking candidly about his struggles with depression and his search for personal meaning, he has helped destigmatize mental health issues, encouraging others to seek understanding and growth. His foray into painting and sculpture has further solidified his role as a multifaceted artist, using his work to comment on societal issues and convey his personal journey in new ways. Today, Carey's influence can be seen in the work of countless comedians, actors, and artists who admire his willingness to take risks and push boundaries. His legacy as an icon in comedy, drama, and personal authenticity continues to inspire, proving that true artistry lies in evolving, challenging oneself, and embracing the many facets of human experience. Dear viewers, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed our content and appreciate our efforts, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. It really helps support our channel and keeps you updated with more exciting videos. Your support means a lot to us.